The second part of the Z11 study was to compare the morbidity of sentinel node biopsy alone versus axillary dissection, and not surprisingly, it shows that there is a big difference between the two. And this has been confirmed in other randomized trials that have compared sentinel node biopsy alone to axillary dissection, the NSABP B32, the Almanac trial. And so what the study shows is that there's a lower incidence of short-term surgical complications like wound infection, but more importantly, there's a significant decrease in the long-term sequelae of the surgery, such as numbness uh, in the distribution of the intercostobrachial nerve, which is the upper inner arm, and lymphedema, which is of course the complication that I think patients most fear of axillary surgery, is also significantly reduced. So in the absence of benefit for axillary dissection, it really doesn't make sense to subject patients to the additional morbidity.